He is definitely good with the blaster. I certainly hope that rude C7 unit didn't send you over here. Those more recent models have no etiquette programming whatsoever. Beep a deep deep. I think he should be replaced or shipped down to maintenance to direct droids there. But I cannot seem to convince my masters of the logic of the request. Vreet? They beep a deep beep. Oh, I wouldn't go that far, despite what others would say. A number designation for a C7 unit means far more than an integer increase. Deep, deep, deep. Some droids undergo radical changes with each generation. Each numeric jump in sequence can have wide-ranging changes in functionality and temperament. But then, you are a new model yourself. I wouldn't expect you to understand how it feels. Now, was there something I could help you with? A droid feeling? Oh. Deep, deep, beep, beep, deep, beep, deep, beep. I see. Well, good day to you then. Ah, good day to you then. Maintenance droid. Hey, you working on this box? I will just take what's ever inside, yes? Maintenance droid. Maintenance droid. Ah. Uh, some more droid stuff. I don't know what it is. Hey! I am sorry, but only authorized cargo droids are allowed into the warehouse. I cannot permit you to enter due to the sensitive cargo Beep 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 boop. No. In fact, I do not have you on my list of Codin's acquisitions. How did you get in here? Beep 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 boop. Bop bop. I see. Well, I have no current use for you. I'll assign you to C6E3. He needs the help to make up for his inferior program. Whoa. I don't know what the difference is. I'll lie to him, because that's what I feel like doing. If you do not wish to comply with these instructions, I can have you given a memory wipe and behavioral reprogramming. Hmm. Good. Now report to C6E3. You will be assisting him. Sorry. I don't even know what I said, man. Oh, you're back. What can I do for you? Beep 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 doop. That C7 droid absolutely infuriates me. Needs help to do my job, do I? Beep beep doop. I would be happy to help you, but as long as that C7 unit is perched at the door, I can't. Ah, do. Well, if the C7 unit were to be disabled, my programming would require me to take over his responsibilities in his absence. Doop doop deep. Yes, I would be willing to give you access to the next room. Beep 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 beep. Uh. Malfunction. Yes, what is it? Beep. You can't be serious. I am not in need of the activation. What are you talking about? Beep beep beep. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him trying to fight us. Look at that battle stance. Oh my gosh. That is a battle stance if I ever saw one myself. I don't feel like using any special attacks on him. He's ridiculous. Oh look, we got the regeneration, so we regenerate like Need help. What's all the commotion? <laughs> oh, I see. Well, that will show him. Obsolete piece of junk, indeed. <laughs> beep, beep, beep. Yes, of course. I'll get that open right away. Thank you, sir. Just a moment. There. Thank you. Ugh, you're such a good friend. Let me just get his molten cannon. Why didn't he use that on me? Hey, what's up? I'm further into the warehouse now, guys. Communication destroyed. I don't know if I want to talk to him. He might throw me out. 
Whoa! Oh, hey, I'm supposed to, uh... I get it. Oh, okay, so I only have three moves, and I have to make the top one look like the bottom one. Well, before we do that, let's go... Alright, so he's trying to fix something, and uh, since we can't help him, he doesn't want us over there. Alright, so, we need to get... That, like that, no, reset. Reset, do it again. Um... Center counterclockwise. Yeah, and then the right clockwise. And then the left counter. Hey, look at that! I can solve puzzles very well. Very well indeed. What's up? Oh my, you startled me. What are you doing here? Uh deep beep boop boop boop. I monitor the transponder codes of all ships leaving the docks. Then transmit departure information for any of Bog of the Hutt's freighters. Did The information is sent to a remote computer system. Beep beep boop. Oh, I see. In that case, I will upload the transponder codes to you. And here is the blank transponder card you need. Beep beep beep. You're welcome. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must go back to monitoring the traffic. It is important that relevant departure information is relayed as quickly as possible. Well, that was easy. That was easy if I ever indeedy said it was peasy. I guess we can't help him. Who are uh, you? Uh oh. You're not supposed to be here. No! 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 We will be forced to take drastic action. Surprised statement. You are foolish to think we will allow you to take that information back to your master. Amused query. I think you will find the odds are somewhat in our favor. Now will you be giving us the codes or not? No. Incredulous statement. Then we will have to take them from you. <laughs> then we will have to take them from you. To begin with. Let's save it. I don't trust this. I don't trust myself in this situation. Um, where's some iron grenades? Sonic? Sonic grenades don't work, do they? Oh, so do they. Sonic! Sonic grenades go. I have so many of them. <laughs> Look at these guys. Fight me on the battlefield. I dare you. I have grenades. Yeah. Okay. That was easier. Systems failing, master. Hey, we got uh, another HK part. No, HK! HK! You guys are a joke. You guys are so funny! You threatened me! Ha! That's hilarious! Please enter the warehouse. Yep, I'm entering the warehouse. Wait, where are you going? You are not authorized to leave the warehouse. Goodbye. I'm having a nice walk. It's a good day out. Today. Hey, it's our astromech droid. I thought you got sold. I don't believe this. 
He says he's got the transponder. Did they actually the try selling him? To hijack Bogus freighters. We can change the ID signature of the Evan Hawk and get to Godo's yacht that way. We could go to the repair shop by the landing pad to overhaul the Evan Hawk's codes. From there, we should make a nice target for Godo. Count me in. Yeah, right. You're the one who wanted to sell him to Godo in the first place. Yeah. And I don't like being cheated. Trust me. Goto's yacht is going to have some pretty heavy defenses. You're going to need all the help you can get. All the help that you can get. Yes, we already know about all of Mir's wonderful, magical, special abilities. Ah, this guy. I don't know which one is the right one. I think it's this one. What if we pick the wrong one? What would happen? Game over, just like that. The Evan Hawk will be intercepted by Goto's yacht. Two party members will be able to board it to save Kirji Narahija. Who is the first person you want to send? Oh shit. We got Visus, who's new. We got Mira, who's new. We got classic Atten Rand. We got Bayodur, who's not much of a fighter. He is more used for the tech stuff. To my understanding. The handmaiden, who is a soldier, she was a beast. I think I'm gonna end up taking her. Who's the second person? I am leaning toward Visus because we haven't done anything with her at all. Except fight her. So let's let's get her out there. See what she can do. Or Mira. No. Well, uh, I, I kind of want to get Mira because they're the two that I want to uh, make into Jedi. So. I don't know, man. I don't know. Visus. I will flip a coin. I have a coin I will flip. Just give me a minute. We will do heads for Mira and uh, tails for uh, Visas. Ready, set, go. And drum roll, please. Not really. Okay. It's tails. Tails, Visas, it is. And there is a cutscene where the ship gets up and it starts to fly. Uh away and then there's another ship that looks like an airplane combined with the uh, CIS fighter things and it's coming after us it's aiming aiming its turrets at us and we stopped and now uh, I guess we're docking with it because it's gonna abduct us And now we're back in here. I really hope that didn't mess up any of the audio again. Because the last times there were cutscenes, the audio got desynced, and that was, a, that was not fun. Mm, I was expecting someone taller. I hope you are not in too much pain to hear my words and understand them. I am Goto, one of the officials representing a percentage of non-sanctioned trading here in both the YouTube system and Republic space. And I had a question for you. Are you a Jedi? Uh... Apparently not. I was cast out of the Jedis for some time now. You have a job for me. Well, um, 
And it is a very strange way of asking for my help, if I do say so. There are easier ways to get my attention. Yep. There is something important to me I need protected. The Republic, it is broken. What happened on Paragus has set in motion events that I can no longer control. Not to be melodramatic, but I fear it has broken the galaxy irrevocably. This has occupied much of my attention, and there seems to be no predictable way to resolve the situation. So, you care about the Republic and how the galaxy is coming? In one standard month, the Republic will collapse. Not due to war or secession, but because it lacks the infrastructure to support itself. It is unknown to all but a few, but the Sith won the Jedi Civil War. Even with their supposed victory, the war left the Republic on the brink of collapse. Rather than remain and help solidify the Republic, however, Revan chose to leave known space. A frustrating turn of events as a rallying figurehead could have done much to restore order. Alright, so you want me to help save the Republic? That's pretty cool. You're a pretty cool dude. You just kind of have a weird way you don't know how. You don't have very good social skills. That's what I'm getting at. Um, so... How can I help? There is something moving in the galaxy that lies beyond the ability of my instruments to detect or predict. I believe it to be a legacy of the Sith, but I have been unable to determine the source. Whatever this presence is, it is staging strikes at key figures throughout the Republic, and through some unknown means, it is causing the destruction of worlds. Qatar, a Miraluka world in the Mibrim, was one such place. I have reason to suspect there was a gathering of Jedi on that world when it was rendered lifeless. I cannot find any pattern in these attacks, and it is a source of frustration to me. There is some clue, however, that perhaps the Jedi are linked to these attacks, or that the targets are significant in some way I have yet to discover. Ah, okay. Well, that's pretty cool, I guess. Um, 